G'day and welcome back for more Escape from Purgatory. Capac's buying snacks and Kanajashi's playing the sax. I don't know. What okay. am I doing? Animaniacs. <laughs> Capac, what are you doing? I'm trying to get a cola, but it's not working. <laughs> it's because you're not pushing the button, you're pushing the screen. What? I thought it was a touch screen. No, you need to poke a bit higher. No, higher. Down here. No, higher! Ah, do I push me around when I'm trying to get a drink? <laughs> po po poke yeah, higher. I give up. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Dang it. I'm not thirsty enough for this. <laughs> Alrighty, so today I thought we could probably get some progress on maybe some improved piracy. Right. You both need to print off a new v copy of your fighter ships. Mm -hmm. And I presume you'll iterate on that design so we can try and improve their function. Capac, well, he needs to iterate on the design and the piloting. Try what? not boosting against the speed limit this time, Capac. Uh, to conserve fuel. That's fine. Uh, <laughs> and I need to protect my hydrogen tank a little bit better. Yeah. Also... There was a suggestion that I've been, that I think's a good one. Um, perhaps we could make it so that the pug-nosed diamonds could attach to the sides of Kanajashi's fighter, if he thinks that can work. Because oh. then you can, then you could carry them to near the battle, then detach, and then they use their own fuel supply. Or we can do that go. already with the connector. Sorry. Yeah, but there's only one connector. If we put a, if there's a merge block on either side then all guns are facing forward as well. So it's like block. when our powers oh, combine, we become 38 Gatling cannons facing forward. <laughs> <laughs> that would be devastating. Yeah. Ah. Oh. There's no room on my design for a merge block. Just slap one on the side. That's not very aerodynamic. Capac, why did you just vent this space? I saw that. <laughs> Didn't happen. It's a little hasty going out the door. Is the outside door closed? Yes, it is. Okay. Yeah, it auto closes, thankfully. Uh, and while you two are working on that, I'm going to go and work on the booze bus and integrating this uh, wasp ship into it. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, actually, before you guys disappear, uh, come and meet me at the wasp. The what? The wasp. That's the ship we captured. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Not the wa, the wasp. Wah. Wah. Wah, this guy, huh? Wait, there's another ship? Alright. Oh, it's still got all of our auction bottles in it. <laughs> so, you guys didn't find the secret room last time. What secret room? Well, we were kind of busy, like, fighting and... I know. I thought I'd, uh... Running away from things. I thought I'd educate you. Okay. Come in here. Wait, is it this room with the beds in it? Yeah. Cool. There, sh there might be stuff in the lockers. Why don't you guys have a look? Uh, access denied. Uh, you're going to have to grind and break uh -oh. your way in. This sounds like a lot of work. Just humor me, would you? Bullets and a gun. Uh, power kits. Ooh, power kits. That's handy. Oh, I just got some bullets. Uh, a data pad. Oh, what's the data pad? Uh, let me see what uh, I got. Oh, oh I yeah. It? Got some better tools. I thought I picked uh, it up. All right, I think I'm done. All right, come back, oh. read it. It says, Handsome Adventurer's Log, start date 06022287. My companion and I have awoken from cryosleep aboard the SS... What's the name of this ship? Yes, that could not have worked out better. Ah! Oh, amazing. Oh. <laughs> what? What are you plotting? <laughs> you, you don't feel those lines are familiar, Capac? No. No? Had some adventurous logs. Start 8060 
My companion and I have awoken from cry asleep aboard the SS. What's the name of the ship? I haven't found any registry data. The serial number on the hull is RX-39487. Hmm. Divine Adonis Adventurer's Log, start date 0602227. My trusty companion and I have emerged from cryostasis aboard the RX-39487. The ship is damaged and we are stranded. Where are we? Oh, why do I feel like I've been tricked? <laughs> yes. Is this an inside joke? I just don't know. Uh, sort of. It's from Light Echoes. From what? Is it? Yes. I don't remember that. It's from episode two. It's the intro. Oh, right. It is two. <laughs> you wrote it. Yeah, a long time ago. <laughs> Oh, man. I um, thought for sure you knew what it was when you were saying it. Uh, does anybody need a level one welder? No. Uh, oh. But yeah, you guys can get on to making your fighters now. I'll work on this behemoth. Oh, all right. I got, I got sort of just mesmerized by uh, I noticed. Fixing, <laughs> uh, fixing some rubber blocks. Uh, I don't know how this machine works. Well, Kanajashi's there to educate you. You got your blueprint loaded? Well, there's one one there already. Ah, sweet. So you just uh, retract it back until it's as far back as it can go. I do have an on-off switch for all of the things with the left button of this button panel. Oh. Down here. How uh, smart. For the welders. For the welders, and then we just need to put a block here so that that'll attach, so like a small conveyor. Uh, I've got a feeling this may not work very well. It'll work great! Oh, here's the panel. I printed one before. About. Yeah, but something about the base only having like 200 steel plates makes me think that it's not going to go exactly. I'll just build some more then. Ah, oh, look how quickly that's going. Uh, you may need to mine some more iron as well. All right, I'll go dig some irons. All right, then that's just down the tunnel here, right? Down one of the tunnels. You could also do the um, one that just says, like, hey, we always keep 100 of everything sort of thing. Oh, yeah, we could probably get uh, start running his inventory manager. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe I'll set that up once I've got this thing as owned by me take the uh oh. i hope that's the skippy it's going against hopefully what do you think about two of the cargo containers from the wasp ending up there on each side cargo containers huh yeah see how the wasp has those four cargo containers okay they're kind of where the wheels used to be. Yeah. Ooh. Do you want to put them on some kind of detachable rig? Uh, I didn't want to. I was just going to try and figure out how I could merge block them in there. Yeah, there's not really much else I can do to this thing. Can you work out a way to add a few extra fuel tanks to it? Even if that no. means fattening it out a little bit? Uh is it okay if I extend this piston? I'm going to sh schmuck you. My schmuck your... Uh, hold on. Oh. Move to the side the a little bit, please. Thank you. How about causing mayhem at the docks? Not parking in the right spot? Well, I'm not yep. causing no mayhem. Mayhem, cap accidents, all the uh, things you do. Why can't I... Why can't I name this oh. grid? That didn't sound good. Uh -huh. They weren't fully welded up, so it's fine. Uh, the grid is owned by Kanajashi when it first gets made. Because uh, he owns right. the projector. So you just got to take ownership of it. Ow. Silly <laughs> welders. Um, you, you could put a safety device on there. No, it's no fun that way. <laughs> so you said these tanks explode when they get hit. I think that's, they're supposed to. All right, well, that's not going to work then. But as as we tested earlier, the little ones don't explode very much. So remember I shot one in front of you back when we were down on the surface? Before we destroyed the booze bus, I shot one in front of you and it didn't explode much. I thought it was going to. I thought it was going to be funny and then it just was disappointing. 
Ah, remember that time I tried to kill you and it was disappointing? I did tell him to stand back. <laughs> I like how there's an airlock to the um, medical room, but there's like everything's pressurized on both sides. Yeah. Uh, it's because the it was back when it was the server, just in case we ran out of gas for everywhere else, the, at least you'd spawn in the med room with oxygen. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. That probably wasn't a good idea. Did I just hit something? No. Wait. Oh. Hmm? Oh, no, I didn't hit something, but some of my bits became disconnected. Uh, just random things floating around the place. Oh, I see the merge block you're doing. Okay. Yeah, I was about to do the big reveal, but I lost all my teeth. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think... Oh, uh, hmm. No, that still works. It'll be a bit slower in some directions as you go, but... My modular pug is complete. I like it. We can... I'll have to make sure I've got, uh that on each side then so you guys plug in you turn off your dampeners then i'll coast us to the f the battlefield mm -hmm. and then well we're, i mean we're close it'll be like detached that's, that's not even it though tap i can connect multiple of them together the way he's done it yeah, yeah. so with this one you could stick like an extra one on each side oh my god you got them on the top and bottom too yep you can make a whole Ow. wall of these things. It would be <laughs> oh, like no. it would be like in that um, Guardians of the Galaxy, yep. in that final scene where all the ships connect. Uh, and then all you got to do to pipe them together is remove the facing engines and replace them with two conveyors. Uh, Kapak, why don't you get rid of those engines? No. What do you mean get rid of the engines? Well, they're not needed. What do you mean they're not needed? There are still two in each direction without them. And with them there, you're going to have to figure out how to switch them off once you merge to something. Well, it, while you're merging it, you switch off the ones that you're not not going to use. But okay. So just manual? Yeah, because I still want it to be functional on its own. Yeah. I suppose three thrusters is better than two. Nice. You've lost four guns though, haven't you? Yeah, on the, on the merge version, it loses some of the guns. What was I doing? Oh, that's right. I've set up the auto crafting. It should be working now. Um, and I have automatically like what, hundred pieces? Uh, there should be enough with the snacks that I made, like fifteen hundred steel plate, that sort of thing. Oh, um, nice high numbers. Yeah, yeah. Go big or go home. Enough that we can just be like, oh, I need a new fighter. Press the button, prints the yeah. whole thing. Yeah, and exactly. then it'll refill as we're doing our stuff. Yep. So good news. This wasp has eight almost fully charged batteries on it, which I'm going to try and merge onto the booze bus so that we've got power. Excellent. All right. My ship has been printed up and is good. Cool. So now to do my changes. Uh, does anyone mind helping just to make sure I don't smack the booze bus on the way out? Uh, sure. As soon as I grab some food and water, I can be there. So, I, since I've disconnected it, it hasn't got any power, so it's got no lights on it. <laughs> so it's in complete darkness, and I can't tell whether it's got All a right. clear run to outside. What direction are you gonna go? Uh, out. Out of the asteroid. Wait, are you gonna try to navigate this thing out oh, while so this driving... other thing is sticking it off the side? It's how I'm going to navigate it. Oh. What's this thing called again? The salvage? So there's the uh, booze bus, which is the grey thing. And yeah. then there's the wasp, which is... What's Capac grinding? The uh, spotlight that you left floating in mid-space. Yeah. Uh, yeah, looks like you've got clear on all sides here. Oh, it's a bit... You're a bit close on this side. Eh, he's got space. Oh, it looks like you're okay. Yeah. Just watch out for the rock behind you. And the rock in front of you. And the rock, the rock behind you. me? Oh, yeah. Yeah, down to your... would be, what, your bottom right? And don't hit my solar ship. Your solar hit ship's your solar ship, there. got it. 
Ah, there it is. Okay, that should be clear enough. Oh, uh, let me know if you want any rotor turrets on that. I'll be happy to make them. <laughs> I bet you would. <laughs> All right, let's shape some armor around this uh, explosive fuel tank here. Should have done that in the first place. How back. Yeah. Since the booze bus is a little bit your baby, can you come out here and give me an opinion on something? Uh, where have you got to? There you are. So I'm contemplating doing this differently to what I was saying before and instead merging this somewhere at the front here. Uh. So like flattening off that section at the front beneath your cockpit and then the cockpit will come down and look over all this stuff. It does make the ship very long. The other option I thought of was put it toward the back. Uh, why... Wait, why don't you... Why not flip it upside down and put it at the top, like up here? Because I kind of liked the silhouette of the top, as it was, with the with the fuel tanks as we had them before. Uh, alright. Yeah, just put it off the bottom of the nose here then, I guess. That... You're happy enough with that? I know you're not. Agglomination happy. 2. Yeah. An electric boogaloo. Yeah, Inventory I've got my own projects sold. to worry about. Alright. You want to come see the first iteration of maybe what a sort of a side skirt of armor could be like? Oh, yeah. It gives a lot more protection to the, uh, the tank here. Oh, it's so unfortunate that the tank's model is curved, but it's like. It takes up the whole block size. You know what I mean? Yeah. It'd be so nice if I could like bend it over a little bit, so wrap it around of, a bit better. Yeah, it would be. Yeah, I mean that should prevent those few stray shots, I guess, from hitting you. So are you just thinking sides because you're mostly gonna curve around to the side of your targets rather than exposing your top or your bottom? Yeah, at least you would hope so. I wouldn't want to expose my top too much there. And then... Yeah. Guess we'll find out how it goes. Because I could also do uh, just a quick... No. I don't want to just, like, box it in, because that mm. would be silly. But I could just do a quick uh, addition to the top like that. Oh, yeah. Do that on both sides. Yeah, that'll... Give it a little bit of extra fairly skirting. Fairly gap. Not fair if you don't have any weak points. <laughs> You sound like me when I'm designing the Inventory enemies that you're fighting. Full. There's a guppy out there. Right. You guys are still a ways off from being ready, aren't you? Well, I mean... I'm... I don't know what. A few minutes now that I've got the ideas. Inventory I know what I'm doing. Full. Okay. Alright, Kabak. I've... Do you want to have another look before I do the final merge? As to... Because I've got it in a more obvious position as to where I was going to finish up with it. Uh, hmm. May have ground out more than I needed to, but I'm sure I'll need to reshape a lot of this anyway. Uh, yeah, looks alright. You have got it lined up properly, so you're not going to have it all askew off one side, right? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I don't want the goose all over again. Don't clang out. Just merge. Just be happy. Please. Oh yeah, put them, put them there. That'll work. Oh yeah. The booze bus is mobile again. Congratulations. <laughs> it's also got a giant chin. Uh. Uh. Right. It's got chin implants. <laughs> in plants. Uh, yeah, that should that should be fine. Question mark. It wanted to look like it had a chin beard, even when it didn't. Oh, are we going to change its name to Jay Leno? <laughs> Let's see this thing. Oh, I see how you merged it up. Uh huh. Cool. It's a three large cargo containers on the booze bus. And that's going to be the, yeah, the front of it here. 
Yep, we're gonna have the cockpit looking over top of the uh, cargo containers in the front. Yeah. Nice. Oh. It all changed color. Yeah. Magically in front of my eyes. With a dunk sound. <laughs> hey, a dunk sound is a perfectly acceptable painting noise. Am I come surprised you're so calm while I'm piloting the booze bus around? Oh no, what are you doing to it? Well, I mean, <laughs> nothing compared to what I did to it the other time I piloted it around. Yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> the other time he threw it into the side of a hill. I need a camera somewhere on this thing at the front so I don't hit anything. Ah, who needs a camera when you can just listen for the bump? Yeah, fortunately with only a single forward eye on, I can't exactly go fast. Oh, seeing dust off effects, I should probably stop. If you ever want to blueprint off a connector, you can press Control shift b And it'll just do oh, that subgrid. Oh, cool. Didn't know that. Neither did I until a little while ago. I'm just learning so many things today. <laughs> Alright, so... I'm ready to rock. Cool. Now we just need Capac ready to go. And then we can print another Capac ship. So then all three of us can go after the next target of opportunity. Do a merge up and then go and eat something. Could I get one of you to print me off a new copy of my modular fighter? Sure. You got the thing blueprinted and stuck into the uh, uh, projector? It is blueprinted. Sure. Stick it into the uh, projector printer. Uh, how do I tell which one's which? I'll go into the uh, control panel. It should be there's projector printer and the projector printer Kana. Uh huh. Uh, so yours is projector printer. Should be. There we go. Projector All right. The printer pug. Oh, it's not oriented right. Nah, you gotta fix the orientation. That way. And uh, where do I want this thing to attach? Uh, have you left a port available oh, somewhere? You, this, you got an open port? Or did you close them all off? Uh, hold on a sec. If, if you've Close them all off. Just go for the like this um this thruster right here, and put oh, it yep. okay. right where this conveyor tube is. And then at the end, just build that one thruster manually. Uh, that's the right height. A couple blocks. Yeah, one more block back. Uh, you did one more, one more block to the left, and one more block backwards. Yeah, that's one, and then the one block backwards. Boom! Perfect. Okie dokie. Uh, also, should we... We should 180 that, probably. I'm just thinking about... Because uh, that's going to be the first thing it's going to build, and then it's not going to be able to get to the rest of the ship. Oh. Yeah. Didn't it print this way? It did, but Kanajashi then? had to move the way the pipe went for his fighter. Uh, okay. Well, we can print it back to front. Oh man, I really hate moving large steel tubes by hand. Yep. <laughs> yeah, they suck. I have hundreds of them to put into these tanks. Is that set up? Yes, that is good. Oh, you could pipe this thing up to the base. Well, that's kind of what I'm setting up for. Ah. I'm, I just need the Energy tanks in low. place before I do any piping because I don't want to double down on the piping. I'm also thinking that once we hopefully capture another large vessel with our next raid, I might be able to just grind its parts down for bits to just put straight into the booze bus. Just put a nice grinder on the front of the booze bus and just go to town. I... Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! Did you just explode? I didn't know the welders were already on and it started welding as I was moving the projector into position. Uh, okay. what just happened? Yeah, what exploded? It's, it's all good. So it started building the projection, didn't have time to fully build the blocks, and then the piston was still moving it back into position. Uh... And then it squished them, and then it went boom. Oh. But it's okay now. <laughs> it just seemed like a big explosion. 
Oh, it felt like one. Standing, floating six feet away from it, too. All right, and now I activate the timer, and the ship will automatically print. Uh, except there's like bits of scrap metal in the middle. Is critical. I almost killed myself on the welder. Ah, it'll be fine. Good news is the booze bus to Jay Leno's chin is coming along nicely. Oh, hold on, something go right. Didn't finish your gyros for some reason. Oh, oh that's no. not good. That's yeah, really it's... inconvenient. Because <laughs> they need large steel tubes, and that's what I was using. What I'm using. Uh. I think Why'd you, you steal reach? all the large steel tubes? Because I need tanks. Apparently they take a lot of them. Are we out of iron? Yes, we are. Yep. Alright. Three-man drill crew. Let's get on this. Let's get some done. Okay, pack. Ugh, this is exhausting. Stupid irons. At least we've got access to iron. Wow, who drilled extra corridors? Me. Yeah, I told you earlier. Never enough. It's true. I knew we were gonna. <laughs> I knew yep. we would um, run out this episode. <laughs> I wasn't sure it would happen this it. episode, but I figured it would happen. Oh, I was like 100% sure it was gonna happen this episode. It's funny. Ow! Why did you stop in the middle of the corridor? I got snagged on one of the edges of your drill hole. A oh, likely story. <laughs> did you die? Ow! Yep. <laughs> hey, you died and you didn't actually manage to kill me. Oh no. <laughs> this is not the right survival kit. <laughs> oh no, where are you? The planet. <laughs> Time to die again, Kapak. <laughs> Why didn't you just respawn at the medical room? There's only one of them. I wasn't well, thinking ahead, I probably. Saw, I saw a bunch of pennant stuff, so I figured the survival kit must be one of the ones that was up with us. But it was not. You just got that one thruster you need to replace the position of. Okie dokie. There you go. Printed. Not the quickest printing job, but... I mean, you got there in the end. Because we had to stop and mine. It all worked out. I mean, there was the explosion too. Yep. <laughs> oh no, that was fine. Uh, nothing happened there. Oh, did you just make yourself like a little tanker? Yep. Oh, that's cool. Right. Uh, is that remote controlled? Uh, it can be. Or is it not controlled? Uh, it's got the remote control stuff in it. Has it got an antenna? Yep. That's kind of cool. So that's... so... Okay, so we're not using Kanajashi's fighter? So, then what I can do... I can... <laughs> no answer. <laughs> uh... I don't know. Kabak's just doubling down on jobs. Back pile off. Uh, Kabak, can I make a quick suggestion about the antenna on that tanker? Can you, like what? can you increase its range to at least 15 Ks so that we can find it again after the battle? Uh, are we going to attract the attention of bad dudes? Uh, potentially, but I mean, we're out there fighting said bad dudes, so if they get to the tanker, then we're kind of stuck anyway. Do we even need the merge blocks on my fighter then? I guess just in case. Yeah, I mean, my plan was to Kapak not need to make a tanker, but... Tampa doesn't listen, so. Well, these can still be used for that. It's fine. Uh, except I can't find the antenna anyway. Why? There is a Reva Impaler. Oh, I think. Did I change its name? That's there is a Reva it. Impaler. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on it. Okay, the Reva Impaler has detected you. And it's coming in fast. Get back. Come back, stop, stop, stop. Let me get in one of the fighters. Alright. Uh. Where is it out? It's just to the right. Reaver, incoming. Six kilometers. Um, you know, there's not a way to hot detach that fighter. Well, stop and let me detach it then.
<laughs> I like when I'm looking at you guys, I see seven friendly signals. <laughs> Alright, I'm free. Let's do this. Oh, Capac, there's only 42% fuel in this thing. You have to be... Yeah. Mine's got 69. Here. I'm missing a thruster now. Here we go. Oh, what did it hit? I'm trying to think. Did it hit something or did we just smoke it? Uh, it did fire some missiles. Yeah, did they hit the HCSA? So they seem to be heading roughly in that direction. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm? What's this? Oh, oh. Missiles. And ammo. Oh, I got an unknown signal. I'm going to go get it. Considering it's only a kilometer away. Fair enough. Go back. Do you want to come back and collect me? But just fly back to the uh, tanker. Can you um put a? Can you name the antenna on that tanker? Ah, why are you moving? I'm not. You're flying away from me. <laughs> you bumped me. Like I also set my uh, ship to relative dampen, so we're just like coasting along together. Uh, also, we're out of hydrogen. What are you talking about? Oh wait, is the big tank on hot stock? What? No, the big tank. What? Makes as much Ooh. sense to me as it does to you. Hey, this uh. Oh, the big this tank's thing on stock. Uh, nine hundred. This thing had nine hundred ice on it. it nice. Something. All right, Kabak, that's um. Good to go when we next have a target, I guess. This little dock here is getting crowded. <laughs> yeah. Three people. Capac duplicating vehicle rolls. It's bound to happen. Oh, there we go. All parked up. Look, all of these things are very useful. I mean, I guess Kanajashi could now merge two of his own fighters together to have a backup. And if he needs more fuel, he can also use one of my modular tankers. It's true. <laughs> I think that's piped all the way or, through now. Now that I have um, merge blocks on the sides of my ship. I could make script controlled missiles. Uh yeah, you could. Unmerge them, and then they just take off. And take out our enemy before he even gets close. I'd limited success with those things. Oh, same here. They always tend to <laughs> blow up before they get to the target. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad I'm not the only one. A little leopard <laughs> drill. Oh, I got somebody's waste water though. That's exciting. But it sounds fun to do. Not that it works. Yeah. But it sounds fun. Well, I think the base is out of. Oh no! Another reaver impaler incoming. Uh, oh. Scramble your fighters. Launch. Launch. Fighter. Seriously, Capac? Scramble. What? I'm in the wrong cockpit. It doesn't have the switch in it. <laughs> can you not see that? I can. I just don't have the button to do it. Are we, just gonna, are we just going to go in together? Let's do this. Yep. All right. It's like those uh, cloud cars. Oh. Uh, Star Wars. Remember, Capac, Cal lead your target. Yep. Up a little bit. Up. Up. Oh. No. Oh, well, I can see his fire. <laughs> oh, Kanajashi's got it. You okay, yeah, Kanajashi? You look like you got a hit. I, I hit it quite literally. I crashed into it. Oh dear. <laughs> Come back, stop. And I'm undamaged. You're going past the wreck. Oop, turret. Let's go see if there's any goodies off. in it. Wait, I literally bumped into the wreck, and how am I undamaged? Anything good? 
Uh, where's the wreck? There's some bits floating over here. I don't know, it was this kilometers away. And assert Cyclops. Oh, uh, let's go after the Cyclops. There's a bit here floating in the space. Oh, there's a big chunk of this ship here. Anything Ooh. good on it? Got a couple of ion thrusters. It's tumbling out of control though. Which makes it hard. Is that ammo down there? <laughs> no. We should go after that Cyclops though. I'm just every just time it spins around, I'm just grabbing a little bit more of the uh, ion thrusters. Oh jeez. Ow. What did you do? Smashed in the side of the asteroid. <laughs> as per usual. Uh, Wait, that's in your suit or in the aster in the fighter? My suit. Oh, okay, that's alright. I think we My might fighter. be better served attacking that Cyclops. Oh, I got some. Uh, what do I get? I got some. I got, bonus here. I got not much of much use. Eh, okay. Ooh, let's go after the THI 842S. That better? Uh, different. I think. I think we should go after it. Alright, I'm uh got ammo. You. Almost ready. So we should try and head in together, I guess. But uh you guys should probably just go. Why? I'll come in on foot. Okay. I'm oh, ready whenever. Actually, no, I need to go put this stuff down on the asteroid. That's the whole reason I was flying back here in the first place. Alright. I'm starting to drift in. Yep, I'm gonna match you. It's weird controlling this from one side. Uh, which one are you going after? The, the THI, THI one, yeah. So please don't go after the other one and attack it at the same time. But it just makes it more entertaining. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Kamek did that last time. I think he attacked a different ship and spawned an extra drone to fight. Which by some As miracle he should. actually managed to fight. I mean miracle. But you a miracle. Uh incoming space wasp. See the wasp. Should I go on the wasp? Uh you could the try THI is right here anyway. Yeah, I reckon we just try and take out these turrets. The wasp is Oh, Oh, there's a firefly coming Oh, taking a lot of fire! Capac's flying around in his suit. I'm flying around in Capac's fighter and Kanajashi's fighting too. Can we manage to defeat the THI-842? Find out next week when Escape from Purgatory continues.